subscribe to this channel and turn on your notification bell icon. Thank you. Hello, my wonderful people and welcome back to my channel. Today, I'm here to give you an update concerning the heated argument between Governor Wike and Nnam Dekano. Wike, you are finished. Nnam Dekano attacks River State Governor. Nnam Dekano of the indigenous people of Biafra, Ipo, has launched a verbal attack and threat on Governor of River State, Yemsin Wike. This was after Governor Wike has on Friday proscribed all activities of the IPOB in the state and also placed a bounty on the IPOB ringleader. Wike made the declaration in a statewide broadcast over the recent happenings in River State, where the police command reported that IPOB members are responsible for the mayhem in the state. He said, security agencies are directed to stop any form of procession or agitation by IPOL in River State or any part thereof and arrest and prosecute any person or group that identifies with IPOL in the state. Government will issue executive order to strengthen effective enforcement of these measures. Friday being today according to Weekend, IPOL continued with its devilish and destructive activities at Iwebe and Onyibo, then some other places in open defiance of the state government's curfew on human movements. Security intelligence and surveillance revealed that IPOB has continued to expand membership drive, holding meetings regularly and expanding its logistical base, including maintenance of illegal detention cells in Eminike and other parts of Diobu, Portacourt. Only Botan has practically become the group's main operational base in River State, from which they have become notorious for launching premeditated violence and terror on the state, businesses, and innocent citizens. He stated that his administration has severely pleaded, warned, and even advised IPOB and its members to discontinue his irregular actions in River State to no avail. Nnam Dekanu said if he and his group could face the government of Nigeria, Wike cannot stop their operations. If you know Nyem Wike, tell him that I, Mazin Nnam Dekanu, fight demons, not mere tiffy mortals like him, Nnam Dekanu stated. If the satanic British created enclave called Nigerian, is crying to the UK government to save them. Who the hell is Governor Wike to challenge God's project, which IPOB is? Wike should have regard should have regard for the following points as contained in the plea letter Nigeria sent to Britain, begging them to help stop IPOB. Wike, you're finished, he declared. This and many more was the heated argument coming from Governor Yen Sinwike of River State and Nnam Dekano of IPOB. <laughs> if I'm to state my own opinion, I will, I will say that I don't think this is a moment where the two should be doing this. I don't think this is a moment where should be, they should be exchanging a heated argument saying IPOB did this, IPOB did that, we should stop IPOB, we should not stop IPOB, we should discontinue the activities. I think this is the moment they have to look at the problem at hand. They have to look at the problem that is facing Nigeria as large. The problem coming from the NSAS protests, NSWAT protests, the hoodlums and the talks looting people's life and properties. I think that this is the time they should look into the problems like Nigerians are really battling with. The problems that are taking the lives and properties of the citizen. I'm not here talking about IPOP this and IPOP that. So I beckon on Governor Wike and Nam Dekano to sit up and look beyond themselves and not to stay here and be sharing the heated argument. Permit me to read one or two comments coming from fellow Nigerians. One of the comments I have here said, Bros, chill. Weekend as street too. You can't run, you can't outrun him. Ask Amechi what happened to him. The same will go for you, if you don't mind. Then the next comment I have here said, I pop, don't buy market. Wicked, 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 go give them a home training they lack. One other comment says, 
laws of love. Nam the Kano I go don't read they read by now. After all the chest beating, see waiting happen to them. Chest go down they pain them by now because the chest beating don't so much. Anyway, make Buari put chest medicine for eye pops for 2023 budget to help their lives. The next comment said, I just detest this moron and his followers. How can you be in a hideout and be making your followers to air? Then the next person said, You are a bastard yourself. Come back and fight or lead the fight. You don't stay in UK and be dishing out orders to the vulnerable. Hashtag Namde Kano. Then one other comment I have here said, See this Mumu on Namde Kano. You think say River State na Lagos State? We will end Igbos in River State if nothing, if anything happens to Governor Governor Yem Sinwiki. When I go believe and learn new thing. The next comment said, The looting in our land and invasion of the people's properties, warehouses, and Oba Akolu's palace, destruction, destruction of Tinibu's properties, we are caused by talks among us and not the IPOB. The looting Oshobo Ekiti and the Badon warehouses looting were all caused by talk among our youth. Please stop this tribal war. They keep peaceful protests were organized by Yoruba youth. The same way it happens in the non-Yoruba state in FCT. Please, Governor Wike and Namde Kano, you guys should talk about the matter at hand and not stay here blabbing about IPOP that doesn't matter at the moment. The next comment said, Namde Kano is not only raging mad, but is also hell-bent on misleading a lot of gullible youths. I hope you guys should sit up and shine your eye because Nam the Kano is leading you guys astray. Then the last comment I will take says, You and I know that Nam the Kano swears can't hold water in River State. Why is it why are they being stupid? The I pops that some of us don't support Tinibu's empire doesn't make us any less Yorubas. We are responsible for our own views and stand. I pop has has said several times that River State belongs to them. The claim which the people of the state had refuted several times. Wiki has a point for spitting fire. Can they lay claim on Yoruba land? Can they also lay claim on Alsa land? Anyone who believes in this IPOB of 18 should be have a brain check because it is all a crap. All right, my wonderful people, these and many more are the comments coming from Nigeria concerning the heated argument between Governor Wiki and Inam Dikano. Remember that you too can also become part of this discussion by dropping your opinion and what you think concerning this at the comment section. Do I subscribe to this channel. See you in my next video. Thank you.